Hello, and welcome to Tech Magic. In this video, I'll show you how to enable WSL2 on Windows 11 with an easy, step-by-step -step guide. Let's dive right in. Before we begin, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so, it really supports the channel. Restart your PC and press the key to enter the BIOS menu, usually F2, Delete, or Escape. In the BIOS, enable Virtualization. For Intel processors, look for Intel Virtualization Technology on older models or VTX and VTD on newer ones. For AMD processors, enable AMD SVM or AMD V. Turn on the Virtualization setting, then save and exit the BIOS. After your PC restarts, search for Features in the Windows search bar and go to Turn Windows Features On or Off. Scroll down, find the Virtual Machine Platform and Windows Subsystem for Linux, then check both boxes. Then, click OK to apply the changes. Restart the system to complete the setup. After restarting, download the file named Enable WSL from the link provided in the video description. When downloading the .bat file, Edge Browser might show a warning like, make sure you trust this file before downloading. Don't worry, there's nothing wrong with the file. I'll walk you through it after downloading. Click on See More, then select the three dots in the top right corner, and choose Keep, followed by Show More, and Keep Anyway. Inside this .bat file, it has three simple commands. Running them one by one takes extra time, so I created this file to execute them all at once. You can still copy and paste each command manually if you prefer, but I'll run it all at once to save time. Right-click on the file and select Run as Administrator. Click Yes, and it will begin installing Windows Subsystem for Linux. Once the installation is complete, enter a new username, then create a new password and retype it for confirmation. Once you're finished, close the command prompt window. Then, go to the start menu, right-click on Ubuntu, and select run as administrator. Run the command sudo apt update to update the packages. Thanks for watching. You're all set up with WSL2 on Windows 11 and ready to start exploring Linux. If this tutorial helped you, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Tech Magic for more simple tech guides, and leave a comment if you have any questions. See you in the next video.